Okay, let's just say she closed 10%. Okay. Right, let's just say that. I, and she's been here two years. Okay, let's just give you that. That's why you knowing facts, knowing data, knowing documentation, like numbers, is important for you to give somebody an advice. Don't just give advice based on our emotion, right? But let's just say 10%. I will pull her aside. I will take her out for lunch. I will take her because that's an important part of your business. She's been there for two years. Relations being built. Seems like you really care about her. So I would purposely, intentionally say, look, I want to take you out for lunch. Invest a little time on this person and take her out for lunch and say, look, the reason why I'm taking you out, first of all, I want to appreciate you. Use the sandwich method. Always come off a critical conversation, not like bring up the issue. Always start off any critical conversation if you want somebody to make changes by complimenting them, what are they doing right? What are they doing right here? You understand what I'm saying? If your kids today, for example, are doing a lot of things, don't pick on their weakness all the time, okay? Start to focus on the thing they did right, then you bring up the issue. You know what, you've been here two years, thank you, be one of the most loyal team member to me. Your relationship with, with me really means a lot to me. When you speak, I want you to use your heart to speak to that person and look at that person's eyes. Not like a presentation. This is not a presentation. This is like, I really want you to win, and here's the situation, I appreciate you. It's empathy. It's about compliment, what did you do right? And then I'll bring up the issue, and I'll be like, listen, you know, I kind of like look at the, uh, the past last two years, it seems like you did 59 appointments, or 69 appointments, or 100 appointments. You only closed less than 10%, that's not a lot of money. Now, we have two choices here. Number one, we can keep going with this trend. You end up making not a lot of money and lose a lot of deals, or we can implement a new strategy that can help you to make more money. Do you understand that conversation? It's called critical conversation. And you wrap it up by complimenting again and say, look, I, the reason why I brought you out here for lunch is because I value our relationship. But more than the relationship, I want you to understand you are an entrepreneur, you are in sales. If you don't make money, eventually you'll get fired. I don't fire you, you will end up firing yourself. And I, want, I don't want to see that day happen. I, instead of like talking to you six months down the road, it's too late, I just want to have this conversation with you. See, you have to understand how do you communicate with people and coming from an angle of care, empathy, but what's in it for them. Remember, every time when you speak to somebody is what is in it for them. JW here. If you like my content, comment below and download my JW Just Win app. See you next time.